Hi, and thanks for watching. I'm joined in studio now with Rory Neeson, who is the Ward 3 Counselor for Burlington. Thank you for joining us here today. Happy to be here. Now, Rory, you, since the beginning, had a passion project for the city of Burlington and obviously into your ward. Yeah. And it's actually coming to fruition. So why don't you talk to us a little bit about what this project is and what it means for the community? Sure, well, you know, early on in the days uh, of canvassing out, uh, particularly in Brant Hills, uh, the parents identified a need for a splash pad mm -hmm. uh, in that neighborhood. So, um, you know, I did some digging and got an idea of uh, general costs and I really picked picked it up from, from, from the doorstep to say, okay, this needs to be a top priority for city council. Question of fairness and equity and really just a question of fun. Absolutely, and now council has gone ahead, approved this, so talk to us about when the plans are going to be uh, put together and when you hope to achieve uh, right. the full splash pad. Yeah, so um, I think the, the sort of end date to be looking to, and we put it right into the resolution so we have a good uh, solid target, yeah. is summer 2020. Okay. So that will allow 2019 to be uh, an opportunity for consultation with the community about what they would like to see in, uh, in a splash pad at Brant Hills and uh, then we go out to tender um, we go out to tender in the winter so we can save the taxpayer a little money uh, through a winter process and we'll be building uh, next year okay and capital project I mean talk to us about the fundings that are going into this and where the money's coming from etc right so uh, it's a five hundred fifty thousand dollar allocation and that's for the splash pad to bring uh, pipes uh, out to the splash pad mm -hmm. as well as um, having a net uh, by the nearby uh, baseball diamond so above the fencing so that'll ensure that the kids will be safe when they're in the splash pad Awesome. Any other projects that you're hoping to bring to the community or that you're hearing from residents? Well, I, I will say that uh, I'm really happy with how the budget process is going. We approved uh, some new buses, so that'll provide some relief and some more reliability to our bus system. And $25,000 uh, was allocated at the committee level yesterday towards Burlington Arts and Culture. Fantastic. Well, thank you very much for joining us here today. And again, for the residents up there in the Brant area rather are going to be pretty excited for 2020 as you will get a new splash pad for more information or to contact board three counselor Roy Neeson you can do so Roy.Neeson at burlington.ca also you can reach him at his extension at 7459 thank you thank you